What's going on guys? My name is Brian. My name is Stephanie. And, and welcome, welcome to our, our channel. channel. Today guys, we have Overlord Day. Are, Are you ready? ready? Before we start the reaction guys, make sure you guys smash that like button down below. It really helps out the channel and also thank to all of our Patreons and Patreon sponsors. And today's post notification shout out goes to Denji Maru. So shout out to you homie. If you guys would like a post notification shout out, make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe and turn on your post notifications. But yo, here we go. More Overlord. Yes guys, let's see what's gonna happen because last episode we did see how OP Ainz still is. You guys already know, Ainz just continues to prove himself because last episode he fought the warrior king oh my god guys that fight so much goodness we haven't yes. seen action yet of season four that is the first action action that we got it did not disappoint it was I so know. dope that was insane i was not expecting him to revive the warrior king but he actually did it to show everyone so, so whoever he's gonna recruit he is beyond death he is the yes. overlord and ruler of death of, of everything he claimed to the warrior king that he was the strongest in the whole world you know um he can back that up yeah he, he is true guys he yeah. can back that up you know what i mean <laughs> but um yo this dude is walking around level 100 maxed out all stats got probably got all like the legendary weapons in this game when it was out Yes. Um, he's walking around while, while everybody else is not even like close to that, you know? I know. Also, we do have El Nick, you know, that completely surrendered himself to Ainz. But Ainz is giving them some time to think about it, you know, because that was like way too sudden. I know being a vassal nation and stuff like, what the yeah. heck, yo? Like El Nick thought that everything was thought out by Ainz, but he had no idea what the heck is happening. <laughs> but that makes it so funny, guys. So yeah. here we go. Let's see what's going to be happening this episode. Make Make sure as always make sure you guys subscribe to the channel join the notification squad so you guys won't miss out any new uploads exactly and also i want to thank all of our youtube subscribers and all of our new youtube subscribers that have joined our channel welcome welcome guys with that being said no further ado let's, let's get to it. it yo demi urge i never I, I i don't know how to say his name forever guys <laughs> demi urge demi urge ぜいよ。<笑> You can fathom the thoughts of, uh, of a supreme being. <laughs> Yo, I love it, man. They think he, he thought of like countless strategies and plans, but he, in the inside, he's like, What are you talking about? Yeah? <laughs> どういうことです。あれ。because El Nix is too scared, that's why, man. <laughs> Yo, this guy's there you go. Such an incompetent. Oh my god. Ooh. Ooh.あなたが遠慮していると、私自分が動くことで、あなたに遠慮するなと告げたかった。Cool, we're seeing uh, the other characters now. Yeah. Ooh, I like that uh, sculpture, man. Yeah, he actually has one. Mm, Chaltier is there too. Chaltier是的。
Oh. Oh, yeah, because he, he was asking. Oof. If Ainz was really, really more evil, like. I know. Or punishment. <laughs> I like that he's letting everybody say with, with their, their opinions and stuff. It, it's better that way, man. He actually wants to know, too. Yeah. He said it was refreshing when the guildmaster was saying his opinion last episode. <laughs> Please have a seat on him. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, oh yeah, remember I forgot. Oh my gosh, <laughs> this is hilarious. That must be, uh, that's the guild member that made Kokitus. Uh, oh my god. That must be him. <laughs> Damn, guys, I feel like their personalities are changing or something. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're annihilating the Dwarven Kingdom, goddamn. <laughs> Boom. Yeah. Cause, uh, cause... I like that. Yo, she's so strong, yo. When she was fighting Ainz, like, jeez, man. It actually took Ainz a while, you know, to defeat her. Yeah, that title of strongest floor guardian, man. <laughs> and Perroronchino. <laughs> yeah. The names, too many names, guys, of his guild members. Oh, look, this is kid. I totally want one. Hmm. <laughs> All right, let's go. Oh, look at that. The Dwarven Kingdom, yo. Yo. Wow. This squad right here is so OP, yo. Just roaming around the woods. <laughs> wow. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Okay, we have not seen that, <laughs> right? Like, <laughs> look, look, what? you saw, uh, uh, oh my, oh my god. Yo, their faces was like, what? <laughs> プレイヤーかもしれない。そんな場所に乗り込むのは危険だけど、有効的な関係を望む以上、王が直接 mm. yeah, that, that, that rune thing is あ、間に帝国の剣はデミウルゴスとアルベドに片付けてもらえるしな。何があんだよ。タクチルクに船や。He <laughs> He can literally just ask him if he did something and then he would answer, you know? True. But... Wow. Oh my God. Wow. <laughs> Oh, 
今のメモの書き方で大丈夫です。<笑><笑> She's not sure if it's helping or not. Oh my god. とき、アインズ様が何を考えられていたか。そしてそれを自分でどう取り込むかを考えた方がいいんじゃないアリンス<笑><笑>まったく、なんでか知らないけど、出来の悪い妹みたいなんだよね。<笑><笑>ブクブクチャガマ様。ブクブク。弟気味であられるペロロンチーノ様がお作りになられました。シャルペロロンチーノ。フフフフ。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口ですよね。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り口です。ああ、ここが入り He already knows where he's at. Oh, wait. Aura, she's a girl. I remember,、oh, yeah, no? Yeah, yeah. I, I, I forgot because they, they switch. Yeah, it's like, a little confusing. Clothing. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. Gondo Firebeard. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ああ。人間の国に流れてこなくなった。Oh, about 100 years ago. ルーンを掘り込めるルーン交渉はどんどん減ってきておるから。長い話になる。歩き。OK。Letting us know what's up。開発家という方たちは。Oh, he comes from a rune smithing family. かつてドワーフのマジックアイテムはルーンを使った200年前。マジックキャスターによるマカという魔法で強化を増やすのああ、I see, I see, I see。重要なものがルーンを掘るよりずっと短い時間で作る。It makes sense to just enchant then make it so faster。考えるものが多くなってしまったのじゃ。技術を復活し、ルーンでしかできない技術を開発できる。Yo, if i n s can be friends with the Dwarven Kingdom and they can make rune weapons for, for、uh, Ains, that'd be nice. Yes. Why? Oh, I see, I see. Oh, I see. Damn, so much determination, yo. Oh, man. Yo, let's go. That is a lot right there. Mazo Shkinto, Gijit Shamoyuna. No of Nukunikara, Subet and Runko. Korekura no mono Hitsio, Sono Tomeni or Daisho Hitsio, Gondo. What does she need Tomashi or what does Kaku work? Was it a kind of Tomashi? He's gonna do it. Oh, okay. Because his belief is so strong, he wants to revive that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, snap. Okay. They can take care of that, man. Yeah. Quagua. <laughs> oh. Okay. Eat metals from an Oh. Tougher than metal armor? What? Oh! Quagua. Oh, Shaltir. Shaltir's so strong. What's up? Oh, she got this. Oh, she's got this. Let's go. 
Get me some good news. So get me some Kuagua. <laughs> Yo, her form. Her, her. Let's go. We haven't seen that in a while, guys. So so I think she's just gonna knock them out because she can't kill them. Yeah, she's yeah. Right, let's go. So freaking fast, dude. Oh my god, you can't even see them. Oh, they can talk. What the hell? They can talk. <laughs> I thought they would be like just roaring, yo. Yeah. Ooh, going after the leader first. Oh. Oh. Oh, so she got a skill like that? Wow. Some Somewhere there. Oh my lord. What? No damage taken. That is insane. She's too strong. No damage, bro. You can't even damage her at all. Oh my Nothing. God. Uh, I think they're gonna talk. Oh. oh. Wow. You shot oh. Oh. oh my god! Oh my god! Lord Ryuro. Oh snap! What? Oh, Sub, he's trying to be friends with the dwarves. Get them in his side. Oh. Guys, that was so cut off. It's like he's letting him know what's going on with the dwarves, and then you know it, it focused on Ayn's face at the last moment because yo, he's yes. trying to recruit them, but now they're like gonna get destroyed, so he has to, to act quickly, man. Yeah, this Quago. Uh, wolf guy. Yeah, just beast. say wolf guy. <laughs> like, he literally said, you know, that they're about to get attacked right now. Yeah. Or any moment now. So, I'm pretty sure, like, Ainz is gonna be heading there soon. Like, oh, yeah. Probably gonna teleport there or something to save them. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Because, yo, like, he has to get there quickly. He has to revive this uh, rune sm smithing uh, uh, culture right here. And... and tradition you know what do you call this he's gonna do whatever it takes I'm, I'm super excited where this is heading man yeah and you know that was so cool you know what Shaltir did he, oh like, yeah he like captured them so fast and then made this guy talk like she is just so OP as well like. yeah <laughs> charm species like like we, we don't really know the extent of every everyone's skills here and stuff like that like Ayn's made a fortress and stuff like we don't know how much more spells everybody got you know yeah. but this is really really cool yeah they're working with this uh guy lord ryuro mm -hmm. so we're definitely super excited to see what he's all about or she you know um this is the the next uh antagonist here i guess i don't know yeah that's what that's what it's looking like you know yeah. but i'm really curious why do they want to kill off all of the dwarves yeah that's yeah. true this, this true, guy, true. you know, he would have been done for. I know, I know. Yeah. Man, he, he he sold his soul to Ainz and he's gonna be part of the squad and he, he has to get all the other dwarves, uh, you know, to, to work with him, to revive yeah. this culture, this tradition, you know. Let's see what's gonna happen, man. Exactly. Let's see how it goes. Hopefully they can get there in time, you know, to save all of the dwarves. Yeah, man, guys, we definitely cannot wait to see next week's episode. Make sure you guys stay tuned by subscribing and turning on your post notifications. You guys won't miss out any new uploads. And with that being said, until the next one, we'll, we'll see, see you back, back here at Reaction Aura. Peace.